Hole plunging is taking the internet by storm, and while basketball players have been doing this for a while to relieve soreness after games, more and more people have began doing them because of the quote, benefits that cold plunging brings. Well, I am not convinced, and today I'm gonna be doing three minutes in a cold plunge close to 43 degrees Fahrenheit. Now I know what you're thinking. Cold, that's not very long, nor is that very cold. Well, actually it is. For context, the average water that you would get out of a tap that you drink is around 55 degrees Fahrenheit, and water freezes at 32 degrees Fahrenheit. So I will only be about 10 degrees warmer than the temperature that makes water freeze. So is it really worth the pain of chilling to the bone for these benefits? Well, y'all can call me Investigator Cole because I am on a mission to find out the truth and face my fear of cold plunging. Hmm, sound dramatic. I like it. And we're here. This is the cold plunge, and this is Tim, owner of the cold plunge. And uh, Tim, what are we reading on the cold plunge right now? It's cold enough. Can check a little ducky out. I think uh, it's it's, it's uh, could use a little more ice. I oh think. dear. Oh, so uh, more ice. <laughs> this is like getting ammunition for my own execution. It's gonna be a good one. So up until this point in the video, I hadn't really thought of the actual cold plunge. I was more thinking about the production side and how we we're going to get this video and how it was going to look good. Because of my procrastination, as you see, the water got down to 38 degrees Fahrenheit. Y'all, do you- 38 degrees! Guys, that is 6 degrees above the freezing point of water. I mean, hey, call me Ice Cube. The rapper. Before I got into this icy water i had to first go through a checklist number one sign a consent form just in case something terrible happened number two make sure i had a rubber ducky to keep me company because it is lonely in that cold plunge and number three lifeguard there was no more stalling it was time to face my fears and yes not the one about spiders oh, snap. it was time for the great plunge sorry i was trying to do a Ryan tree. But the first hurdle is simply getting in. All right. Ah! Da, 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 da. All right. Three, two, one. The second hurdle that you will face immediately is controlling your breathing. If you do not get your breathing under control, you're going to have a miserable time. Because Bro, that's so freaking cold! Your body doesn't know what's going on and it's gonna kinda start freaking out. The third hurdle is surviving the first half a minute, at least mentally. Cold. I'm just chilling, you know? Breathe is good. Try to drop a little bit lower your shoulders in. Oh my goodness, bro! You're gonna notice your arms, uh, your fingers um, are, are pretty cold. And again, this is about mentally persevering. So keep breathing and remember that your body core is still very warm. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Trying to feel good? No. Don't move your arms. Now the real, the real hardcore people, when the timer runs out, they take a deep breath and they put mm -hmm. their head I'm not under, doing that. Head I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five. Four, three, two, one. We have finally done it, guys. This three minutes was one of the worst three minutes I'd ever gone through. I'd faced my fear of cold plunging. I only did it one time, so I wouldn't uh, feel the effects 
of a cold plunge. I will tell you that night, I slept like really, really good. That's one thing I can best of is that it does help with sleep. And just the fact of me like having to push through it and sharing this video with y'all guys, I think is a big deal of me not backing out. But yeah, if you ever have a chance to cold plunge, I would highly recommend it. Just one time, at least you gotta do it. It's just, it's a, it's an experience you gotta experience. I know this is a different type of video than I normally do. So if y'all want me to keep doing this type of stuff, Please comment your thoughts on it. As always, don't forget to love God, love people, speak truth, and keep Jesus Christ number one in your life. I'm your boy. I'm out. Peace.